Well, many thanks for staying with us. You're watching the news update on Galaxy Television. I am Justin Akadoni, and here are the stories we're tracking at this time. Ogun State Government has brought succor to the physically challenged and wives of slain army officers at battlefront in the state by giving them foodstuffs. The exercise is part of the state government palliative measures for the vulnerable and the poor during the lockdown period in the state. Distributing the relief materials to the beneficiaries at the Stella Obasanjo Children's Home, the Commissioner for Women Affairs, Fumi Fuwakbi, said the gesture was to cater to them in these trying times and also to celebrate the Easter fiesta with the vulnerable. Fuwakbi therefore enjoined residents of the state not to scamper for the relief materials as government will soon begin the distribution of the second phase of the relief package across the three senatorial districts. She explains that the government has distributed relief materials to 100,000 households in the fourth phase, adding that the government is targeting 500,000 households. Respondent, the Chairman, Joint National Association of People Living with Disability, Mohammed Alalika, who commended the state government for the palliative, said the action shows the current administration has the less privileged at heart. The WIDAS coordinator, Nigerian Army Alamala Barracks, Okon patients thanked the government for the gesture, calling on the government to support their children's education. Well, um, the governor is looking at giving them relief packages because of this COVID-19. We have asked them to stay at home. And you know the physically challenged, they are, you know, vulnerable people. They cannot afford to even walk, even while everybody is walking. Talk less of when we ask them to stay at home. In providing relief package for people with disability in Ogun State, we are very, very happy. This indicates inclusion in every ramification of life. My, for the falling hero's wife, that our husband died in Boko Haram, the government did not leave us out. We appreciate the governor, we appreciate every members of REPS, the wives and every entire of the Ogun State members.